Good day! I am John Virgilio Sicabildo, your student nurse for today from our Lydia Academy University, Quezon City. And today, I will be demonstrating the neurological system assessment. And just like everything else, we're gonna wash our hands, provide for patient privacy, introduce ourselves, and verify the client's identity. We're gonna explain to the client what we are going to do, why is it necessary, and how he or she can cooperate. For this return demonstration, we have to prepare and assemble all the materials and equipments needed. Good day sir, I am Nurse Jan and I am your nurse for today. Uh, we will be doing a neurological assessment. What is your name sir? My name is Kriti and I'm your nurse. And your birthday? June 26, 2002. Okay. First, I would like to know if you experience any headache. Wala. Back pain? Nothing. And pain in your extremities? Wala. And if so, the client experiences any headache, uh, pain in the extremities, or back pain, we should ask for the onset and any other aggravating factors. Okay, sir. Do you experience any loss of consciousness? Wala. Fainting? Convulsions? Wala. Trauma? Wala. Okay, um, what about tremors? Ticks? Tingling or numbness, limping, a loss of memory, uncontrolled muscle movements, and mood swings. And lastly, uh, do you experience any problem with your uh, five senses such as um, smelling, uh, seeing, or sense of sight, sense of taste, hearing, and touching? If the client display difficulty in speaking, point to some objects and ask the client to name them. What is this, sir? Cell phone. This one? Comb. And this one? Pamay pen. Ask the client to read some words to match the printed and written words with pictures. What is this? Hand gloves. Ask the client to respond with simple verbal commands, such as, Sir, can you point to your toes? Can you raise your left arm? How about your right arm? Determine the patient's orientation to time, place, and person by tactful questioning. Sir, mga anong oras po kayo dumating dito? Mga 7. Uh, pag ilang beses nyo lang po nakarating dito? First time. Ngayon nyo lang po ba ako na meet? Or familiar po ba ako sa inyo? Mm, ngayon lang. Hindi ako magdalawa po. Ask the client the city and state of residence. Time of day, date, day of the week, duration of illness, and names of the family members. Okay, sir. Sa saan po kayo nakatira? Tama, B na extension, Cabarato at City. Okay. Ah, anong oras na po ngayon? 7.36. p.m. Ah, okay. Ah, anong petsa na po ngayon? Ah, um, 27. Okay. Um, ah, sa tingin niyo po, anong araw na ngayon? Wednesday. Wednesday. Ah, nagkasakit na po ba kayo nitong mga nakaraang araw? Nakaraang linggo? Nung nakaraang linggo, may gusunit po na. Okay. Nung nagkasipol po kayo, ilang araw po siya tumagal? Two days. Pwede niyo po ang pangalanan yung ilan sa miyembro ng inyong pamilya? Yes, ang um, pangalan ng ate ko is Kyla Kate Ambalis. Ang kapatid ko po isa sa Christine at saka si Laura Ambalis. Uh, uh, how about your uh, parents? Hmm, pangalan ng tatay ko ay Melvin Ambalis at ang mami ko na naman is Kyla Ambalis. More direct questioning might be necessary for some people. We may ask, Where are you right now? or what time is it today, just like what we did earlier. Listen for lapses in memory. Ask the client about difficulty with memory. If the problems are apparent, three categories of memory are tested. Immediate recall, recent memory, and remote memory. First, to assess immediate recall, ask the client to repeat a series of three-digit number spoken slowly. 3, 7, 8. 3, 
seven, eight. Gradually increase the number of digits if the client fails to repeat the series correctly. Start again with a series of three digits, but this time, ask the client to repeat them backwards. Nine, seven, three. Three, seven, nine. Note that the average person can repeat a series of 5 to 8 digits in sequence and 4 to 6 digits in reverse order. Let's see if our patient is one of the average person that can repeat a series of 5 to 8 digits in a sequence. 8, 1, 9, 3, 5, 6. 8, 1, 9, 3, 5, 6. Okay. To assess for recent memory, ask the client to recall the recent events of the day, such as how he got to the clinic. This information must be validated, however. Sir, paano po kayo nakapunta dito? Okay. Ask the client a recent information that was given earlier in the interview. Sir, can you recall kung ano pong pangalan ko? Jan Provide the client with three facts to recall, a color, an object, an address, or a three-digit number. Ask the client to repeat all three, and later in the interview, ask them to repeat all the three items. Pink, brush, 543. Pink, brush, 543. And third, to assess remote memory, Ask the client to describe a recent illness or surgery. Sir, have you had any illness or surgery recently? Um, surgery. Anong surgery po ito? Gum surgery. Ano pong ginawa sa inyo sa gum surgery? Open surgery kami kasi may tatanggal. To test the ability to concentrate or attention span, have the client to recite the alphabet or count backwards from 100. Sir, can you recite the alphabet? A, B, C, B, E, F, G, H, M, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. How about, can you count uh, from, can you count backwards from 100? 100, 99, 98, 97, 96, 95, 99, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Test the ability to calculate by asking the client to subtract 7 or 3 progressively from 100. Sir, can you subtract 3 from 100 progressively? 100 minus 3 is 97. 97 minus 3 is 94. 94 minus 3 is 91. 91 minus 3 is 88. 88 minus 3 is 85. 85 minus 3 is 85. Okay. As we said earlier, we have to ask the client to repeat the three items that we let them recall. And now it's the time. Sir, can you please repeat the three items that I let you recall earlier? Pink dash 543. The client was able to recall. To assess the level of consciousness, we have to apply the glass glaucoma scale, which are the eye response, motor response, and verbal response. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Are you okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Um, can you show me your thumb? Can you do this? Okay. And that's it! That was my video on how to do neurological system assessment. Once again, I am John Virgilio Sicabildo, your student nurse from Our Lady of Academy University, Quezon City. Good day!